What pops into your mind when you hear the word sitting? Do you picture taking a bench after a strenuous workout? Or do you picture enjoying the view on a skyscraper? Or do you picture working hours and hours just sitting for seven or, seven or eight hours a day? We usually picture sitting as a favorable stance, a stance which we are the most comfortable and a stance that we rely on the most heavily, especially when we are fatigued. But what if I tell you that your greatest friend is actually your most formidable foe? That sitting is actually a treacherous stance and is actually harming your body. While sitting seems relaxing to some, it, it gives numerous damage to the body. It harms our muscles, it destroys our blood flow, and it limits the oxygen we get. And that's what I'm going to delve into right now. The most prominent way sitting abuses our body is how it abuses our muscles. This posture will look familiar to the majority of the people. We deem this posture as a relaxing one, as a one that because we don't move as much as we exercise, and we think that our muscles will actually be relaxed. But it's actually the opposite. This posture co uh, contracts our brain, uh, our muscles heavily for a consistent amount of time. It wears and tears our muscles, starting with our neck, next muscle and ending with our hips. As this goes on consistently for day and night and year by year, it slowly change our, changes our body structure into an inefficient and an unfavorable way, eventually tearing up our muscles and demolishing our body structure. Another way sitting harms our body is harming our, how it harms our respiratory and circulatory system. Our heart works as a core for the circulatory system as it pumps more than 100 times a day trying to keep us alive and trying to freshen the blood incomings of our body. Even though it's 30 times as small. When we exercise, our muscles con consistently contracts and relaxes functioning as a secondary heart for our body and aiding the burden of the heart. But what if we sit? When we sit, the parts of the body won't get as much as fresh blood because only the specific regions of muscles will contract devastatingly and some parts will just not. As this process continues, this will bring deoxygenation of our specific parts of our body. Furthermore, our lungs will contract, making it us more hard to breathe. And as this continues, it will eventually harm our brain and make us ineffective and inefficient, eventually, uh, eventually leading to devastating consequences. But it is not too late, as everything almost has a cure. Sitting extensive hours has a cure as well. It is exercising. Exercising helps the circulation of our blood immensely by pumping fresh oxygen to sp every region of our body. Exercising also strengthens our muscles and prevents postures going awry because of the extensive pressure that we give to our, our muscles. And as a bonus, exercising helps us socialize with our friends or with our loved ones. And it's, the best thing is, it's actually free. The benefits of exercising is exponential and it has the potential to override the cons that sitting gives to our body. So after this piece, as, we, as soon as we go home, Let's take a moment of exercise to show gratitude of our body, do some squats or walk us across the park, and finally, give the gift that our body deserves. Thank you.